Umbral Spell Portal, appearing as a pair of gloom-filled mirrors bound in shadow, the Umbral Spell Portal forms a passage through which the flow of magic can pass unhindered. Wherever these panes of darkness are summoned, they are used to cast spells across great distances. Those who look with an untrained eye upon the Umbral Spell Portal see little more than a swirl of murky shadow. Some may perceive vague shapes in the undulating ripples across its surface, and in these forms they may see hints of secrets long kept or memories thought to be forgotten. But those able to peer through the veil of magic see a shadowy reflection of what lies on the other side of the portal. Into this they can pour their sorcerous energies, launching bolts of obliterative flame or beams of invigorating energy that pass through the umbral spell portal and emerge from the twin construct. In this way, a wizard can greatly augment the range that their spells can strike, using the dark passage to smite their foes and bolster their allies from afar. Umbral spell portals are summoned in pairs. Two devices inextricably connected by some unseen tether of shadow magic. Stories abound of spellcasters summoning these linked portals on opposite sides of fortress walls, pouring destruction on besiegers from within the safety of their citadel, or flushing an entrenched defender from outside its perimeter. But whoever establishes such an etheric gateway must be forever wary. For an umbral spell portal works both ways. These creations know no master, and they can just as easily be used by their conjurer's magic-using enemy to deliver baneful spells of their own. Furthermore, the dark wound that umbral spell portals create in the fabric of reality is notoriously difficult to close, and often continues to yawn open long after it has outlived its potential usefulness to the wizard who summoned it, but not necessarily to the conjurer's rival sorcerers. So a spell cast into one end of the umbral spell portal will invariably emerge from the other. Scholars of the arcane are divided as to whether it is the same spell that reappears, or merely a shadowy reflection. A bolt of green lightning that passes through the portal may emerge with a much darker hue, or instead of radiating bright light, it may drown its surrounding in darkness. Some posit that the passage linking paired umbral spell portal passes through the darkest corners of Olgu, causing some portion of the realm's shadow to become infused to each spell that traverses it. Grandalthrope the Lesser, a famed scholar of Ahish, became obsessed with understanding what happened to magic as it passed through an umbral spell portal. To this end, she devised a way to transform her body into pure light energy, then walked into the darkness of the rippling mirror to observe firsthand the device's inner working. When she emerged, her white hair had turned to dull gray, and her sapphire eyes were a color of lead, but she was otherwise unchanged, though she stated unequivocally that no mystery lay between the portal's two ends. She began to show signs of growing hysteria, claiming that her chamber arcane, the place which she had studied for decades, now appeared to have more dimensions than it did before.